Well, hello folks, it's Jamil Swift for Gunstock Reviews. We're here in Scottsdale, Arizona at the Dillon Precision Studios and we have a really cool new accessory for the Ruger PC Carbine. It's from our friends at Skinner Sights and they are making a plate that re removes the uh, rear sight that goes on the barrel and then you can attach a, a loophole delta point directly on the plate and it actually takes away the Picatinny uh, attachment here on the sight and it goes a whole lot lower, giving you a lower uh, bore sighting. So basically it's gonna be easier for you to look through it and maybe, just maybe, be able to co-witness with the front sight. But we'll go after that later on. So first of all, our, uh, our Ruger carbine is empty. We're gonna remove the barrel. And this is the only thing we need. We don't need this anymore. And we're gonna go ahead and remove the rear sight and replace it with the Skinner sights plate which actually a steel plate that will eventually hold the delta point. I'll show you all about it. So come on, come on closer and let's do it. First thing, of course, we need the unloaded carbine. We have the loophole delta point pro. This is the Skinner side base. It comes with its own wrench and two screws. These are the screws that come with the delta point. We'll put those here and let's go ahead and remove the rear sight. By using an Allen wrench here, we'll remove the sliding aperture. We'll save that. We always keep everything. Okay, and using a Torx screwdriver, we're gonna remove the base. This is simple. The screws always save the, the old screws, save everything. Never throw anything away. You never know when you're gonna go back to an aperture site. Okay, next step is we're gonna install the base. The holes pretty much line up like that. And of course it comes with its own set screws, which is really cool. And they even send their own wrench, which is really cool too. Thank you Skinner size, so you don't have to chase around looking for the correct Allen wrench. Uh, for this purpose, I am gonna hand tighten it. I am not gonna apply any uh, thread locker at this moment, I want to see how, f you know, by height, hand tightening them, if we're going to need to apply thread locker later. Okay. Once that is done, next step is going to be put your delta point on. Now we're going to put our screws back in and using a Torx tip on my Brownells screwdriver kit, we're going to install these. I'm going to hand tighten these. Um, at this moment, see how they hold, hand tight, there you go, we are done. We're going to take this to the range and have some fun with it. I think this is a pretty cool idea because it keeps your loop hold at a lower bore axis here and we might be able to um, co-witness when I get that um, rear sight from loophole. They have been out of stock for quite a bit of time. So I'm gonna wait for it until it comes back on stock and we're gonna install it. So stay tuned for more. Thank you for watching Gunstock Reviews. Please visit our website at www.gunstockreviews.com for more exclusive content. Please visit our patron page at www.patreon.com slash gunstockreviews. Your contributions would be greatly appreciated and help us grow our selections and frequency of videos.